Hi everyone, welcome to another interesting and wonderful video tutorial. Yeah, I'll be showing you how to save Corel Draw file in different versions. Alright guys, it's very simple and um, very very easy to do, just like I always say. Okay, before we proceed, if this is your first time visiting my channel, do well to hit on the subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell to get notified when I upload new videos. Alright, so let's head on to our Corel Draw. Okay, um, this is a social media flyer I did, and so um, I want to save it in different versions in CorelDRAW. So that's what I'll be illustrating here for you now. All right, to do so, it either use the shortcut key Control Shift plus S, or you go to File, Save as. All right, so. This um, dialog box appears here now. Then you choose file location, document, give the file a name, then save as typed. Okay, see the CorelDRAW file. Then here now, this is the version I'm using, CorelDRAW 22, 2020 here. So it gives you options of the previous versions. All right, this is it. 2019, this is 2019. It can't give you a version above the one the CorelDRAW you are using. So, for instance, if you are using CorelDRAW X8, you can't save it as CorelDRAW 2020. You can only save it with versions below CorelDRAW 8, um, X8, which are X7, X6, X5, and the rest. So, the version I'm using here is Corel 22. Alright, so the versions below it are 29, 2018. 19, 18, 17, 16, and so on. So depending on which one um, you need and whichever one um, is being requested by the client or maybe for printing purposes, but depending on which, which one you want. So in this case, I'm doing it for, let's assume I'm doing it for a print for printing. So I think um, X3, that is 13 will be acceptable because I don't think um, anyone will be using Corel 12 or 11 so I think 13 is more acceptable now All right, so we just select 13 then so I'm just using 13 as an illustration depending on whatever one you want so just have it in mind that if you are using Corel X8 you can't save in you can't save it as Corel 2019 it's not possible so you can only save it as Corel X8, X7, um, S6. All right, guys. Um, now you click on the save button. Now you click on OK. All right, guys. That is it. Then that means you can open it. Um, with versions from 22, um, 20, 21, 20, and so on. So um, that is it for this video on how to save Corel Draw, how to save um, Corel Draw file in other versions. Alright, if you find this video helpful, do well to hit on the subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell to get notified when I upload new videos. And do well to comment, like, and share our videos. Thank you for watching. See you on the next video tutorial.